Hey guys, Leech here, and today I'm just going to be doing a tutorial on how to L2 since I've had uh, quite a few people commenting upon my movement and just saying it's quite like irregular, probably because I do abuse L2ing this year even though it is nerfed, but other than that we can get right into the tutorial. Hey guys, Leech coming in from post, and apparently only 15% of you is subscribed, so if you do enjoy this tutorial by any means, a subscription would be huge, and uh, yeah, other than that, now we can get right into it. So, something you want to keep in mind while learning how to L2 is the directions you can do it in. If you're a lefty, you cannot by any means, I'm clicking L2 right now, I cannot do it towards my forehand side, and if I were to be a righty, I wouldn't be able to do it in this direction. If you go in any other direction, like towards the top right boards, towards the top bottom left corner, bottom right corner, you're, you're able to open up towards the middle, and it isn't as viable as it used to be, but it still has its niche uses here and there, which I really like using. Yeah, so let's get right into how to make your L2 shifty. Now, for shifty L2ing, it is kind of um, an acquired skill. You have to practice it a bit. Like, I've been like messing around with it all year. I have a lot of hours on this cam just in free skate. But I would say, like, you can tap it. You can get nice little taps going if you want the most simple. If you want to just open up or, like, open up and throw a pass. Like, that's probably the most simplest form of L2-ing. Or we have uh, glitch goals on our video where it's just an L2 backhand. Very simple. But to get a shifty um, L2 movement, like, this is more so, like, spins and everything like that. Just, like, if you have a guy on you, you can just spin off and then get to the middle. Something like that. All you're going to want to do is just, like, open up the way you want to go and then you just kind of turn into it but the first part of that just to simplify it i'd say just go your way hold the l2 and once you get turned around you just finish the turn off with your left stick so i turn around and i just finish it off with my left stick so yeah if there's a guy in front of me i can just turn around and whatever so that's pretty simple but let's get right into the next step we'll have a whole progression for this so I'd say the next step for like simple from simple L2ing would be just um, holding it on your forehand or backhand to like tighten up your turns. So you see here how my guy does a pretty tight turn and the puck is protected. Um, other than when the puck's directly in front of me, I have my back to the play most of the time, which is uh, kind of a side effect of just how they've um, nerfed L2ing this year but you'll just have to live with it if you want to utilize it. But yeah, I'd say once you have this movement down with the basic turn, you can start pulling it over. So like once you turn, you can kind of use your forehand or backhand glides to tighten it up. So let's say I'm going this way, Perfect. I turn, and I can pull it this way, or I can go like that. It's really up to you how you want to do it. But um, if you want some like a video of me playing with it, I, you can watch my streams. I stream all the time, uh, good to answer questions. But yeah, so just make sure you're able to hold L2, turn, and then just tighten it up with the forehand or tighten it up with the backhand. And yeah, you should be good for the next step in the progression. For the final step in the progression, this one is something I am trying to figure out myself, but it's just like implementing a protect the puck turn into my L2. So like if I were to L2 here, and then maybe L2, it's it's mainly pretty hard to get off just because of this um this turning glitch when you're L2ing. As you see, my guy just absolutely starts tweaking out for no reason. I'm sure that's just because it's patched out and they probably didn't think people would be trying to move like that, but yeah. Um, anyways, like, just to get you, like, out of your L2 with speed, as you see there, I just sharply turn, and then I can just go into it. It's, it's really pretty, it's pretty simple, but if you do it too early or too late, um, there's not much merit in it. But, yeah, that's the third progression, so all I'm doing, essentially, is just opening up, uh, turning, and then just clicking in my left stick. I, I, I am on skill stick, I'm, I'm pretty sure it would be the same for, um total controls but yeah if you have any questions about um anything i brought up in this video um please drop it in the comments uh, i stream all the time if you want to come by and watch me l2 in games or um if you have any questions that you'd like answered immediately and yeah that's everything for the video um if you liked it um please drop a like if you really enjoyed it a uh, subscription would be huge for us as we are nearing almost 300 subscribers which is even crazy to say for me but yeah that's all for now so i'll see you guys later peace out